Dr. YouTube. Dr. YouTube Tucker here, guys. Like and subscribe. Check this out. I mean, I get goosebumps because, and I rarely do, because this is so epic. I don't think viewers and listeners understand. There's no doubt now, whether Trump is for real or not, and I, and I know he's for real in my gut, and I can see it politically. He's breaking all the taboos. He is wrecking the insiders. He is changing the system forever. And it's just a manifestation, as you said, of the larger uh, political uprising of populism. And Fox News is the worst now. I know you go on Megyn Kelly and there's some nice folks over there. But Fox News has this talking point. Oh, I know. It's just, it's just poor white people and, and, and racist whites. I mean, it's like MSNBC now. And they're just putting it out that... You know, Trump's really a Democrat, and oh, it's racist and all this, because it's whites that feel like they're getting poor. When his campaign isn't about race, it's the, it is so sick. Do you think that that tactic will fail? Well, uh, the, frankly, there are far more egregious offenders than Fox. I've got to say a word in defense of Fox, because uh, because Bill O'Reilly, Sean Hannity... Oh, Sean Hannity's good on These that. guys have given Trump uh, his fair uh, shake, and that he and his point of view is at least reflected. You know there's orders coming down probably from Murdoch to... Well, compare that to CNN, which is the Clinton News Network. Uh, uh, All I'm saying is, shouldn't Fox be more supportive of a populist conservative? I, I think they are supportive of okay, him. Good. I, I do think he gets access, and he gets his chance to to to, uh, to uh, lay out his case to the American people. So I, I am not a critic of Fox, but I'll say this. I am a critic of CNN. Now, it's very interesting. Alex, I went back and had to look. Since August of last year... I've either been on Fox Business or the Fox News Channel to talk on behalf of Trump, to defend Trump, to stand up for Trump 49 times. I have been on CNN exactly three times since August. So I get your point. They Yesterday they announced that I am banned. Banned from what? Banned from something I was never admitted to? This gets even more comical. MSNBC, under pressure from Media Matters from America, this uh, group of twisted freaks who are... Clinton apologists, who the Clintons can do no wrong, first they demand I be banned at CNN, where I was never admitted, yeah. now MSNBC, where I have not appeared once this year, and appeared once last year. They banned me. How do you ban someone who's never been admitted to so, begin with? So, so why are they announcing it? Just to set the precedent for banning people? Well, because they know I have the goods on the bushes in the Clintons. Because they know, as someone who was an insider for 40 years, who someone who was uh, in the service of three American presidents, who worked on nine Republican presidential campaigns, as someone who worked in the U.S. Senate as an assistant to Senator Bob Dole, a patriot, as someone who worked in the U.S. House as an assistant to Congressman Bob Steele, who is a member of the House Budget Committee, they know that I've seen the inside workings of the establishment. They know I have the goods on Hillary Clinton. They know that I'm well aware of the fact that her husband is a sexual predator who has attacked multiple women, but more importantly, that Hillary has been an accessory after the fact in every one of those sex crimes. Uh, they know that I'm well aware of Bill's abandoned, mixed-race son, Danny Williams, who they threw away like a piece of trash and who they doctored up a phony DNA test. They know that I have the keys to defeating the Clintons, and therefore Stone must be discredited. We must discredit him because he knows too much. Well, I'm now to your point, you're... You're right about Fox. I would just expect them. I mean, obviously, they're not as bad as CNN or MSNBC. I would just expect them with a patriot like this, a clear winner, uh, not to do little jabs and stuff. So that's why I'm upset with Fox. At least they're, they're a real news network. When they say fair and balanced, they are fair and balanced. And I want to say, put on these glasses or start chewing concrete. I have come here to chew bubblegum.